and we're live here at the CS50 Fair. This is Jason Hershorn, and I am here with... Sophia. Katie. Logan. And can you tell us what year you are, what house you live in, and why you took CS50? I'm a sophomore in Courier House, and I took CS50 to get an introduction to programming. I'm a sophomore in Adam's House, and I took CS50 because I want to do a secondary field in CS. I'm a sophomore in Cabot. I just thought coding would be interesting and important to do, so took CS50. And you're all sophomores, yeah. but not in the same house. How did you find each other to do this project together? Uh, we were friends yeah. outside we know each of other CS. From math, yeah. And then, I don't know then how... We were yeah. yeah. Do you enjoy working with each other? Yeah. yeah. What it's was been, it's been a fun time. What was the best part of working in a group? Um, just like bouncing ideas off of each other, probably. Yeah, and like when you're working with a group on a project, it's it's fun to be around people, your friends, you know. Yeah. So it, it made the 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 project itself more fun. Did this strengthen your friendship or tear you all apart? <laughs> I hope. <laughs> okay, well let's see the project. Can you tell me the name and 15 seconds? why you made it and what it does, and then we'll look at it. Okay, the name is Run Tourist Run, and we made this game, it's essentially you are a tourist in Harvard Yard, okay. and you're trying to take as many pictures as possible, but not be caught by Securitas. And we just made it because we thought it would be a fun concept. Yeah. So, Can we yeah. play it? Yeah, of course, of course. Yeah. Okay, you want me to try it? How about one of you demo it for me? Okay. And then I can try. <laughs> okay, demo. Logan, let's see. <laughs> All right. So, space bar to start. You're this tourist in the upper left corner. Where? That's me. That's, okay. that's you, like in the blue. Guy. Yeah, it's like, it's like Pokemon. And Securitas is in red. <laughs> and you're just trying to evade Securitas while finding these uh, photographable objects yeah, in so yellow here. So, for example, if I go up here and I click the space bar, I just took a picture of the John Harvard statue. Um, there are more. The score increments at the top. You can, a, only go on the paths. Uh -oh. you can only go on the path. You can only go on the path. So now I might want to avoid oh no. that guy. Oh no. <laughs> if I hit this door in the bottom right, yes. I enter the next level, Widener Library. Yes. So this looks like a crypt. Is that how it felt when you were there for office uh, hours? Yeah, yeah, of course. So you can just keep, you know, um, going here. We've got more photographable objects. The Securitas are a little bit faster this time, and we just got to avoid them. That's okay. And then the final level. When you hit the door again, is Annenberg. So we've got uh, a quite fast uh, Securitas <laughs> following me right now. Oh, boy. <laughs> um, and so, yeah, the same thing. Where, same are you thing go, where are you heading? I'm trying to just make them follow me. Take a me. picture of Red Spice Chicken? <laughs> <laughs> no, we've got the stained glass windows at the top, which we will see in a second, um, up here. So you can take a picture of these. If, <laughs> Sorry, right. Fast photos. <laughs> if I were to uh, die, the level is reloaded. My okay. lives increments down by one. And then um, when you reach the door in Annenberg, you sh we should get a windscreen popping up. Um, doors in the bottom right again. You made it through a brain break. <laughs> and then you win. And it has the score. That's, let's give him a round of applause for Logan. Well done. Congratulations. So when you were implementing this, what was one technical challenge you encountered when you had to implement this? I don't know. Well, okay. So I feel like designing the levels was not really a technical challenge, but it was a real big time suck because we like yeah. hard coded in That's very all true. Of well, the levels. And the collision yeah. detection, I think, was it's a little bit weird. Yeah, it's 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 difficult to get yeah. the enemies to follow the player. It's Securitas, not enemies. They're just Secur doing their job. Right. right, right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Of course. It's difficult to get Securitas to follow the player on the paths without being caught and just like not moving at all. Um, so if you're like, if you're separated by a barrier, um, you would ideally want them to go around the barrier to follow yes. you, but that's very hard to do. Yeah. Um, so that was that's difficult as well. Um, there are also some problems with the sound, like making sure it like cut off at the appropriate times and didn't loop incorrectly. And I don't think yeah. the sound was playing. But we have yeah. some. Music. I'll take your word for it. Yeah. That the there was work excellent. to do there. Yeah. And so with some of these technical challenges, did you did a TF help you? Did you go to office hours? I think we just kind of worked through it. We spent a lot of time on it and uh, asked each other when we were having problems. And yeah, I don't know. I mean, and coming so coming in to CS50 months ago, how what was your background in computer science? Basically nothing. Background? I take an AP CS uh, A okay. in high school. Okay. And I have no background. <laughs> no background. Okay. 
Now, whether you had some background before or no background, how do you feel now about computer science? Uh, much better. I think we have the problem-solving tools to approach a lot of CS problems, which I really appreciate. I definitely feel more comfortable. I enjoyed learning like the different languages that we did in CS50. Yeah. I feel better about it. I, I also I like it. Um, I like the logic. You like of it. it? Yeah, I do. A ringing endorsement. I love it. <laughs> I like the logic of CS, um, and I think the things you can do with it are pretty cool. Do you think this is the you're going to go beyond this in the world of computer science? Probably. I'm very interested in biological research, so Ooh. all kinds of things like Python are very helpful with that. Fantastic. Probably, yeah. Like I said, I wanted to do a secondary in CS, okay. so I'm probably going to take more classes. C or Python, which direction do you like? Probably Python. Okay. Yeah. Really? I mean, I've already done Java, which is also like an object-oriented language, like C, right? I think. There can be elements of that in yeah. C, sure. Yeah. But I feel like Python's like really applicable to a lot of different things. Okay, that hurts these feelings, but okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> I think I will. Um, I, I, it's just I'm more interested in, in statistical, uh, you know, applications to you know other problems. Um, so if I might look at money and politics, I might want to look at statistics. And there's a lot of it to do that, right? Right, exactly. <laughs> you want to so, put more in it or get it more? No, of no, it get out. it out. Okay, okay. Out. Um, so statistics and using CS to do that could be useful. And. I know with this, when a lot of times when there were challenges, you worked together as a team to work through it. But during the course when you had challenges, who was your TF who helped you out that you want to give a shout out to at office hours or just in your section? Who you want to give a shout out to? I think my TF, uh, Ahab Chopra, did a really good job. Um, Why do you tell him? He's watching now. Ahab Chopra did an excellent job in our uh, sections. I thought I felt much better after section to do the P-sets. Who do you want to give a shout out to? Um, Montague Maware. Right there. Yeah. I feel like he did a really great job in sections like leading different like exercises and stuff. Fantastic. Yeah. Who do you want to give a shout out to? Uh, Shrey did a really great job and I also appreciate Veronica at the tutorial. She was amazing. With those shout outs, we'll say goodbye to our friends. <laughs> we'll say goodbye to Secure Toss. Oh, they're coming now. Oh, no. So we'll send it back to you at the desk. <laughs>